Hey everyone, um, this is my speech to text extension for Sami. It can utilize Google Cloud, Microsoft Azure, and OpenAI to transcribe your speech. So, for example, we should get an alert right here. Hello world, how are you? Okay, that works. You can also just hold a button to transcribe it. I'm holding this button to transcribe this. And like I said, it supports a multiple engines. So you can select which one you prefer. And you can also make it stop transcribing automatically when it detects silence. So if we do this and then hit this button, it should automatically detect when we stop speaking and transcribe it. So I'm transcribing this. I mean, I'm speaking and now I will stop speaking and it should transcribe it. There we go. Um, you can adjust the silence threshold and the amount of seconds as well. But let me show you some pretty exciting examples of what you can do with this extension. Hey Sami, set button color. Dark blue. Hey Sami, set button color. Crimson. Hey Sami, set button color. Corn flower blue. Yes. Hey Sami, send message to Discord. Um, so I am sending this now to my Discord server. Uh, hello world. I'm not sure really what to say, but it seems to be working. So here we have a function. We will copy it to our clipboard and we will ask Sami to explain what's happening in this function. Hey Sami, use my clipboard and explain in a few sentences what's happening in this function. In the given JavaScript code, there is an asynchronous function called sendBase64 chunks, which takes in a base64 string, chunk size, and additional parameters. After triggering the event, it waits for 10 milliseconds using the setTimeout function. Thank you. Hey Sami, create new website. I want you to create me a simple website with a button show a joke. Whenever the user presses the button, it will call a public joke API that returns the joke. The joke will be displayed in an element on the page and the website should use bootstrap or styles, have a nice blue theme and just make it look all very nice and presentable. So now, after my prompt is transcribed and processed by ChatGPT, it should open the HTML file. Any moment. And there we have it. Show joke. Hey, Dad, did you get a haircut? No, I can't. Okay. It seems to be working. Well done.